Welcome back. Now we're looking at the gold. Um, and as you can see, we have been on a quite bullish run uh, the last uh, few trading sessions. Uh, gold is at an all time high at the moment. And if we uh, go significantly back, we can see that this is uh, an area that we have not tested since the financial crisis at the end of the financial crisis in this period so this period this area will be a significant level it has historically been uh, uh, an area where we had significant resistance we have uh, four uh, tops here and uh, we will have to have some extremely bad news um, going forward well in technically expect more bad news to going forward because uh, the world economy is basically shut down and gold uh, and heading for a recession and gold is always um, a safe haven when we have a recession but i do believe that we are going to uh, to um, to see a, a decrease in the value of gold at least it will go down to uh, to uh, the, the 1700 level before we go uh, and test the 1800 level so expect oil to uh, to decrease to around this area here around 17 area where we could see that we had a lot of uh, activity activity here the last few trading sessions and then we will most likely continue our trajectory to 1800 before going down again you can also see that we have a uh, upward trending uh, moving average uh, and we can also see that all the other indicators are uh, fairly bullish and uh, as long as central banks continue with their expansionary monetary policy by printing money and uh, expanding their balance sheet and so on and this um, uh, crisis continue people will continue buying gold as a safe investment so yes oil will most likely in the long run medium run and the short run go uh, higher from from here thank you very much